Hello and welcome back to another play on Total War Free Kingdoms with Sima Young on Legendary Difficulty, where this very well might be the final episode of the campaign, actually. We're going to find out soon. Um, before we find out, though, last time we uh, had confederated, or well, not confederated, we annexed, really, um, Sima I. So we have him in our faction now, which is great. We're going to keep his army around. I'm going to basically completely overhaul the entire actual army. I mean, the only unit that's staying is... Well, actually, two. This one and that one, <laughs> from the looks of things. Um, and also, actually, I know I'm going to have to replace this guy, of course, because I, I need a I need a calf guy in here rather than that. Uh, I did have some good calf... Well, then again, aren't you just... You're a legendary dude, right? Yeah, I don't really want to lose him. I guess I could give calf to him, but that's not really exactly what I had in mind either, so I don't know. Also, we have um, five turns until we can recruit Protectors of Heaven. So I'm, I'm kind of tempted to make this a little bit longer than it needs to be, essentially. But we'll have to wait and see exactly what the plan will end up being. I am going to besiege here. Um, we are going to get sallied out on if I do that. I think we're going to attack with the Sima way army than this one, because it's got the best units in it. It's got those two spearmen as well. This arm is actually quite good. It's got the two spearmen, it's got uh, the heavy spear guard. First time we're going to see these guys in action, by the way. For me, just first time in general. Uh, the rest is, I mean, it's all level one though, so it's not going to be great. This army here is not particularly exciting too, but the garrison is not bad. Um, I'm not going to fight it, because I don't want to fight a battle against this. Um, so I'm going to just starve them out. I'll move the army, other army in range, but I do expect them to uh, night battle it. Uh, I'm also gonna fight this one this turn, I think. But again, I am in the what do you call it? In the business of uh, of take, taking as long as humanly possible here. I'm also gonna send you all the way down here and see if there is an army or if there's a town around here that is actually owned by them. So yeah, that one isn't. So we'll keep going further. Hopefully not being this attacked on the way. That is also not his. I don't know. I think that that whole province is that. Um, well, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Maybe there... Because, yeah, currently doesn't look like there is anything that belongs to him. So I may have to trespass for this guy's land and we just attack him in the backside. But I kinda, I'm kind of hoping that Sima Ying is out there somewhere and we can just attack him with our main army. And of course, there's Sima Liang in here as well, which is uh, interesting. Other than that, we have a couple of armies here just kind of sitting around. It's not like I really have much to do with them, but I was going to send you after this, so... You might as well. We're not quite fully replenished, but not to the point where I really care, so... Let's get you going as well. Uh, I, you're probably retiring here. I don't honestly know. Are you my wife, Lady Cheng? Yeah, you are. You're also just kind of there, not sure what to do with you, so... Uh, Lumberyard here, Weapon Craftsman, we can do whatever we want here, so I guess we're going for income, ju judging from the fact that I left that building up. Um, I guess I have tons of buildings to do still. Right, didn't I? I mean, I have this whole... All of this I have to convert still, if I want to play it the old-fashioned way, where I make sure everything is up to scratch. Which I guess I did say I'm doing, so... Um, I need to remove a couple buildings here. We have massive food production here, which I'm going to stick to. So that's got to go, and then I guess this one's going to go. And we'll keep this up, and then those two are going to be the usual buildings. Upgrade that, because why not? Um, so let's go for all the actual like provinces we have here. Make sure I go through them one at a time here. So this is also a well, rice paddy toolmaker. We could go either way here. We have peasantry income, food, and income from uh, industry. I guess since we already have this, we'll keep that. Uh, you're going to go the fuck away. Food buildings. I guess I could go food and industry. It sounds like it's, it's a weird, weird combo, to be honest. That's something I tend to do. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm demolishing two buildings right now. That's already enough to get the right buildings here. Yeah, this combo is a bit weird, honestly. But, hey, fuck it. Let's try something different for once, right? So that's Ling Ling. So then we got Changsha. Changsha. Alright, so we need, um, we just got the income from commerce one here, fair. Okay, we also have income from commerce. Yeah, so this is definitely an income from commerce place, which we currently have a couple buildings for already. So we're not going to have any food here. You can fuck right off. You're going to be converted as well, and then you're going to stay. Alright, so that's Changsha done. What is this? Wuling, we only have one part of the place here. This Lombriar, we only have one. So may as well upgrade that. Then we've got uh, Yu Zhang. 
which is a rice paddy copper mine livestock farm. So two things for food. So we're definitely going to go food here. So that needs to be converted and that needs to be demolished as does that. And I think that is not it. Okay. Holy shit. We have a, I have not, I have, oh, wait, I heard about this. Um, this is interesting. That's actually kind of funny. I hadn't seen this at all yet so far, but I just, uh, earlier today, I read a comment from one of the people, uh, from the other YouTubers or content creators on the content creator Discord for the Total War game, uh, or games even. Um, someone said, I have building slots available. I upgraded the town. I had building slots available, but I can't build anything. It's like bugged. And uh, I appear to have that same problem right now. So, no slots available. Well, fuck it. I guess we're not going to have any building slots available here. And then we've got this. We've got a tool maker here, so we definitely want to go for that. Um, which means you can stick around. The food buildings are going to fuck off. How am I doing for food, by the way? 206 still. That can stay. And then we got this, which is going to be converted over to massive income, please. Uh, I guess we'll go for this one. My, a little bit of food still. And then we have three building slots available here. Which, yeah, we can build something here, so yeah. We'll still convert this over first, though. Okay, who are you? Would you like to be my vassal? I can't vassalize anyone right now. I don't know who this is. I feel like this person could easily declare war on me. I am currently trading as well as having an aggression pack with you. Okay. Would you like military access? No, no one wants military access with me. Beyond Bing wants to trade. Right, was I going to attack you? I don't think I was going to attack you anymore, so perhaps this is a good idea after all. Beyond Bing. How much is this? 2.5 grand. Do I need more money though? I mean, what am I making right now? 24 grand. Uh, it's not like I need more money, but uh, fuck it, right? I can always break this later on. I'm already the most treacherous person in the world anyway, so... Can't say I care that much. I would like to trade with you as well, but that's still like 40-something. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Um, other than that, we are... Oh wow, he doesn't want peace anymore. That's weird. That's fucking weird, don't you think? Right. Let's see here. Let's build some buildings, shall we? Oh, we certainly shall. Um, cheapo buildings. Oh my god, can we, we can get this level 4. Whoa, we unlocked level 4 for this building. Oh man, that means we got a lot of options available. Um, god, it's just so much shit that I skip past because one tick upwards immediately skips past everything. Just flies straight through, don't it? Where am I? That was the one. Uh, that one please, 1080p. Then, yeah, I guess we're upgrading this as well. Wait, 220 dollars. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, yep. God, I should stop building one-turn buildings, he says as he builds more one-turn buildings. Yep, just... Wait, did I convert the other one? I think I did convert one of them. Hold on. Upgrading. Upgrading. Wait a second. Pretty sure I misclicked somewhere. Because I got confused, but it says it's upgrading. Um, yeah, that was the, that one's fine. Was it this one then? Yeah, the 220. No, I did, I did choose the right one, the right one. Apparently 220 is just the fucking cheapest thing in the world. Okay, fair enough. Uh, Liak, tube maker, there we go. So it's that one. One fucking turn again. Hey, we can't do anything here. Fantastic. Fucking one turn building again. Give me this one. It takes three turns. Fantastic. Uh, and here... Well, I'll tell you what I want here, my friend. I want going for income from commerce here quite clearly. I'm not sure why exactly. Let's get the military infrastructure here too. And then I want this upgrade here. We've done it. Holy shit. Now we got loads more to do because we got more buildings we can upgrade, except for those ones for some reason. Oh, right, because it needs to be level 5. Never mind, so I still can't do shit. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, that one upgrade, please. Oh, we got loads of shit to do here. Great. Why do I have this building here? This is terrible. Where is this? Gaoli. Oh, we've got another province I didn't do yet. Okay, fair enough. And Hepu over here as well, but that's fine. Yeah, upgrade that one. All right, so that needs to go away. I'm going. I am going for income from industry here, but we got that one. We got this, which you can convert it. We got that. We got the marketplace, and then we got for some reason a food building. Okay, so this is going to be the probably Confucian and military. Well, the Confucian temples at this point are kind of pointless too because I've I've got so many. Um, that's I can't. I don't think I can even improve my research anymore. My research rate. 
Holy shit, that was expensive. You see, that was 1,320 bucks for that upgrade. Other places give it to me for 220. What the hell are you doing? And this is all... Oh, no, here we go. One more. This is all a bunch of baloney. And next turn, we got the same fucking problem. Uh, okay, I definitely didn't do anything with this place yet either. Poor young. Sorry. Copper mine, iron mine. Yeah, this is definitely going to be industry income, but that can still go away. As can Actually, no, that one can stay. Sorry. That's the other one. Yeah, that one's fine. Uh, oh, and we already have this. Wow. Would you look at that? Is that the right one? It is the right one as well. Wow. Wow, that's crazy. Okay, cool. Right. I've got three armies here. Why don't you guys just kind of head on south? Just move normally, actually. Just go down this way, just in case the Jin Empire decides to get, you know, a bit um, touchy or something. Do I have military access here? I definitely don't. Well, go this way. And you kind of go east or something. I already have an army here as well, though. Right, you're going to go back here. Alright. Um, yep, that's the plan for all those. We have another army that hasn't moved yet, apparently. You. Why the fuck you at? Oh, right, this, this situation here. Okay, so do I want to besiege any... Do I want to take any of these? They can't reach me here in a single turn. So I guess I could just take both those towns right now. Kind of wanted to... Well, let's just see what's over here first. Maybe I'll just 2v1 this one. Oh, you run away that way. There's, there's an actual fucking army in here. Oof, with some interesting stuff. Have you got uh, night battles available, per chance? Well, isn't that just inconvenient for you? That army is going to come back next turn, but that should be okay. Can I reach them? I most certainly can't. Um, what's the garrison like here? That's no. Uh, I still haven't seen him himself, by the way, which is unfortunate. Yeah, right. Let's besiege this. I might be able to auto-resolve this right away. Although maybe I won't. Again, I might not want to do things like that anymore. That's the Caesar mod for the moment. Let's see what happens. You're going to back up. Back it up and do it again. And then is it auto-resolvable? Just out of curiosity. It is. We have Pyrrhic victory, though. Would you like to surrender? No. Fair enough. I understand that. Um. Right, do I do this battle right now? I guess I will. It's, uh... This is a lumberyard, though. And we have no knife... We have no explosive shot. You know what? Fuck it. Starve them out. Starve them, then. For all I... Actually, yeah, I can just bring this army over and auto-resolve that one. It's piece of the campaign even further, but I think I've I've accepted the fact now that this is going to be um, the last episode. I have to just figure out what to do. What other other videos I'm gonna have to record? Maybe do I maybe I do start a new campaign? I just won't be able to finish it. Wow, that's the worst bow I've ever seen. That is actually incredibly shit. I've never seen a bow that bad. Surely someone can use it though. <laughs> Here you go, there's a bow for you. Not quite legendary just yet. Fair enough. Alright. Uh, yeah, let's fix that back up. Actually, is that going to repair itself? Oh, it certainly is. Um, yeah, I guess she'll continue moving, to be honest. Oh yeah, this is the Chu Spearman. That's what I wanted to see in battle. Well, we have this the Chu Spearman here too that we'll see in battle, so it should be okay. Right. Um, I have 22 more things here, but that I actually can't do anything with, so whatever. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna get Sally out on here in a night battle, but it's okay. So really, it's just, it's that town, that town, that town, that town, that town, and that town. So we're five towns away from winning this campaign right now. Also, never even checked this uh, Sima I gone as well, so just Sima Ying now. Just steal, boy. It would like, it would be nice if I could do this before Sima Young dies. Watch Sima Young die now, by the way. <laughs> During this end turn. Okay, no one's Sally Oh, hello. Is he already at war as well? Is he joining in? <laughs> Yeah, these bastards have been on my lands for fucking ages now! <laughs> Finally, someone's arrived to do something about it! Alright, they didn't sally out me here. S sally out me here? Sally me out here, which was interesting. Very interesting. Loads of ready for duties. So many doodos. Okay. Okay. Koi. Fucking 55 koi now <laughs> in the bank. Uh, you got to just normal speed for a sec. You're gonna completely change your army around. Just entirely. Ugh, what a waste to not use Archers of Jing. Right, so since you're um, low level, sorry, uh, you are replacing all your units, 
Actually, I could keep the infantry of Jing. You know what? Let's do that. I'll replace that one. And then we have a very weird fucking... I wish you could just drag that one over there and switch them around, but... Right, so you, I don't know what to do with. I feel like I need to replace you with a cavalry commander. If we have one. We have Sun Yesheng or Sima Shuo. Shuo or Chuma. Are any of you legendary characters? I don't think so. I don't really want to replace my legendary guy, but I could make a new army with him, I suppose. I suppose. Alright, let's just um, grab whoever... I should have used my super scroll. Um, or maybe I am... Oh, you, can't, you can't use cataphracts, can you? You can use my unique unit, which is, you know... That's something, I suppose. Um, it just... Yeah, I don't know. It just doesn't really work, does it? Or you just make this army entirely different. You know what? Let's fucking do it. Let's just go for something different. You get some pro fucking dragons, boy. Some pearl fucking dragons, boy. And then you get some Shanbai Raiders anyway. That's not the right unit. Get them out of here. That's disgusting. And then you... Fuck it, we'll go all out. Switch this whole fucking shenanigans up over here. It's not like I don't have the money, right? Let's get some of these boys in here. Are you... Yeah, you're explosive shuttable, so... I'm still gonna get some trebuchets in here. Ye olden trebuchets. Okay. There, that's an army. We only have two units of cav, which is absolutely horrible, but we have fast-moving infantry. And by fast-moving, I mean they're slower than these guys. What the fuck? They, I mean, these guys are obviously getting buffed by something, but Jesus. <laughs> they are actually... These guys are 40 for you. That's impressive speed, you gotta say, for a fucking um, heavily armored infantry unit. That is some impressive movement right there. Right, so I, yeah, I don't have any way to get there without trespassing, so let's just get a move on. I am gonna just move normally now, though. But you didn't see me coming from here, did you? And I guess, yeah, you're just on your way, same path for now. That fucking movement is absolutely immense. Look at him go, sailing down the fucking river. <laughs> like he's never sailed before. Yeah, I think you're retiring. Um, are you just gonna run past this shit? I mean... I can't really auto resolve this one. Are you actually at war with them, by the way? No, you're trading. You're oh, you're allied. What the fuck? He's coming to help out. I was wrong about you. I thought you were helping me out, but it's clearly I was wrong. Um, I'm gonna upgrade this again. The garrison here, we must. Yeah, okay. Well, we're replenishing super fast, so if they want to attack that, oh god! But they're replenishing super fast too. You know what? This would be a perfect place for a new army, wouldn't it? Hey. Soon you Shang, I like you. Because we can get some big old cataphracts of you. And I'll take, uh, I guess, Lu Zhao is fine. Sure, why not? He's level 4 dude. Yeah, you can have him. And then, we'll have Lu Min Shen. Min, yeah, she, she seems like a great, great character. Wouldn't you say so? Or Xiong Shi. Um, I mean... Both are technically possible. You know what? I'll take uh, Xiong Shi. I still do like other care. I do. I do. I do still like my uh, champions a little bit more. I gotta be honest. All right, give me all of that. You or do you have explosive shots, sir? No, you don't. Well, that's not a problem, though. We can work with that. You are going to get. Um, you know what? You're gonna get some good shit too. Fuck it. We're going all out today. It's the end of the campaign, right? Although. At this rate, it's not going to be the end of the campaign this episode. Maybe we can sneak out one more episode. You're going to get uh, four of these boys. And then you're going to get two of these. Why not? Why not, right? That's what I That's what I think. Why not? All right. Man, and people say you have to play Matong to do a cavalry challenge. I think these boys, zero upkeep. Actually, 26 upkeep, but I think we can work it. Um... Alright, that army will be basically fully replenished next turn, so we'll be okay. Looks like a solid army too. Are you the best commander here? I'm sure you are, but let me just check that. You get the replenishment, not the movement rate though. You currently have the movement range, but not the replenishment. Eh, I'll keep it as it is for the moment. Actually, no, the replenishment is not as important. You can be the commander. Uh, right, gear. Does anyone want some gear? I have some gear, I'm sure, for some people. 
I happen to have this here item for you. Do you like it? I hope you do. Uh, let's get some more replenishment. Why not? It's only for the characters, but whatever. Here's a... Um, here's a big old spear for you, and I'm sure I've got some armor laying around as well. Uh, ooh. This one has a Lord of Fire set. Uh, oof. I do actually have the Heirloom Spear available. Well, it doesn't say... I says it says I don't have it, but I... No, for a fucking fact I do. Or don't I? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I do. There you go. Heirloom Spear. Alright, you're gonna have to downgrade for a second here. And our newly acquainted man is going to get your Heirloom Spear. That should give me the Lord of Fire set, except it didn't. But that's okay. Alright, who did I take that spear from? Was it you? It wasn't... It wasn't me. It was you. Yes, it was. No, it wasn't. Was it? I don't know who, who it was. I don't even fucking know anymore. Either way, this is this is what it like. This is what life is like now. You just don't know anymore, right? Anyway, um, oh shit, you weren't supposed to use that. My bad. You were the one who was supposed to use that. And then, there you go. Plus twenty percent melee armor piercing damage for the entire army. Pretty good. Now you can use this axe here. Although I was supposed to give that to someone else, but yeah, fuck it. You use this. And the other guy who I took the spear from, who I don't remember who it was. One of you two, I'm sure. It doesn't matter, does it? Fuck it, keep the spear around. What do you have, by the way? You have a shitty spear. You have a horse that you really ought not to have. You have a expertise and cunning. Not really the greatest thing for you either, if I'm being honest with you. I'm gonna give that back. And you definitely don't want this authority, so... Fucking derobe this man real quick. Um... You. Wow, I have no more armor for you. That's men madness. Madness? This is actually Sparta, but that's okay. Um, cunning and expertise. I don't actually think I have many people that need cunning. Or expertise, to be honest. You, this is an upgrade for you, I suppose, but... Did that make you... Le no, you were already legendary. Um, I have some satisfaction, though. Here you go. Would you like you would you like some it's better satisfaction, not the greatest satisfaction in the world. Here's some authority as well while we're at it. I don't know why I'm bothering with all this stuff, guys. I, you gotta I, you gotta believe me. Um Okay. What what else do I have now? I've been giving away so many fucking items I've stopped keeping track exactly. I took a bunch of shit away from him. What have you got by the way? That's fine. That's not good. Take that away. Give it to this man here. And then, fucking right click it, then, Jesus Christ. And you can have this replenishment, because, you know, someone's got to use it. Um, we got no gear for you, it's quite unbelievable, I know, but there it is. And then, you can keep the rest of you. Here's a better sword for you. Probably quite a shitty sword, actually, but hey, you gotta make do with what you got, I'm afraid. Um, and then, I think we finally covered it. Alright. So, what else do I do this turn? I can't do the battle there, I don't want to do the battle here. Actually, well, it's the same one. I don't want to do the battle there, I don't want to do the battle here. You're gonna move over here. Get over here. Um, and you are going to also get over here, I guess. 4v1. I mean, that's just a lot of old now, isn't it? I don't want to, though. Surrender. Damn. Gotta say, that's, uh... A little surprising. Okay. Push out. Can you reach that town? No, you can't. You're a loser. Um, Alright. Maybe I'll just move you over here. No. No! No, I'll, uh, I'll just keep you right where you are, actually. It's fine. I'm going to fucking build all these buildings. Yeah, I think we're going to have... We're going to do one more episode here, I'm afraid. I don't think I'm going to be able to do this in, in this amount of time. Uh, this was going to be in... This is going to be... Uh, in sure, income, marketplace, why not? I'm sure people at this point will be con seriously considering, like, what the fuck are you doing? Just just stop. Just stop building all these buildings then, if you don't want. But I do want, though. That's the problem I have. Military infrastructure, please. I want this to be... The perfect campaign. I mean, look at the amount of money I'm making right now. You don't get to this kind of success being a lazy motherfucker, huh? You guys ought to learn a thing or two. 
Just gonna spam every single building I have. But yet another reason not to play to the late game, by the way. Like the late, late, late game, like where you just finish everyone off. Hey, they're build they're working now, never mind. Although it wasn't working last turn. Uh so this is food. Right, I don't know why those buildings are even being built, but here we go. Let's go for some food buildings. Which food have we got at this point? 214. Jesus Christ. Build that up. I could finish it right away, why not? Do it, finish it even all the way. Increase my income further. Oh no, I'm running out of money. What have I done? Oh well. Better luck next turn. Okay. And that one, sure. Just because we have the money. And we're not the yeah twenty six k turn. We still have five armies that have yet to be moved, but that's just here, right? A camp. Um, right, yeah, you were gonna go in there, so that's done. You were gonna go in there, that's done. You're gonna go down this way. Oh god, no, 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 don't attack. Wait, why did I not even? That wasn't even like an attack order or something. That was just <laughs> attack, and apparently the game was like, yeah, that's a normal thing to do, attacking your vassal. No, I I always do that. I don't want to trespass, so let's go that way. Then we got this one here. Uh, yeah, you can also just go into encampment stands, I guess, just so I know you've been moved. And that's it. Okay. Let's go. Yes. Oof, he's moving. Oh, he's, he's trying to stop my army. Malwen. Sorry for the burp. He is, uh, oh, he's actually on my border now. What the fuck are you doing? Should have finished this campaign already. I'm fucking up. <laughs> I'm being declared war on. Treaties being broken. All right, so that person who declared war on me is right here. Wait, is that the only town he's got? Yes, I think it is. Well, I'll just build an army here then, won't I? Um, yep, yep. Wait, hold on. Someone else just declared war on me as well. Faction developments. Oh, we're two turn, three turns away now from getting that. So we did unlock uh, yellow, yellow dragons and jade dragons. Many dragons have seen light today. I'm gonna level up for whatever reason. Get it done, son. Sure, get that buff. Come on, get it. Get that buff. Oh my god, I have two people that are actually unhappy. What the fuck? You best slow your fucking rules, son. Are you currently in an army? Where are you? Nope. And... Nope. Well... I just saw two people getting fired, is what I saw. Right, I need to find uh, the, the people. You. You're 60 years old. See you later. And... Oh. The other one was over here somewhere too. Tufa lady. You're out of here. That's what we do to people who don't like me. Right. I do need to recruit an army here to deal with this. Did, did anyone else declare war on me? I think it was just him, right? I can also just run that army over there, but that's just too much trouble. Where am I even... I guess yeah, I'm just going down this way, just in case. Um, okay, I'll build an army here. After I upgrade this military... Yeah, that actually needs to get... You know what? I'm doing that right away. Fucking done. Uh, that one. Boom. Better garrison. Upgrade that shit. And come at me now. Alright, cool. Now, let's build an army in this... Oh shit, I just upgraded the town. And the town is down here. Well, that was relevant. Um, I can upgrade this, but it actually destroys the garrison. So I don't know how useful that really is right now. I will also build the Confucian temples here. And I'm going to raise an army, as I said. So, it's going to be led by Sima Sho. He looks like a worthy person to be leading my army. Then we have uh, Gan Jinjin, or Sima Ningjing, that is one of my daughters, or Dongmo. Yeah, Dongmo is one of the good ones. He actually has explosive shot too, yeah. And then we have uh, a melee character. Could be you, because you like both characters. Characters, you like both characters, don't you? I have no more champions available. All right, so it's all a bunch of one level ones, isn't it? No, you're level three. Right, it's you. You're gonna get yellow dragons. Fuck yeah, let's do it. Different armies. It's time to experiment a little bit. Do I just go um, jade dragons near too? I've never used jade dragons before. Have you got any buffs yet? Yeah, you do have range block chance for melee calf. 
Alright, not in here. I never used these guys before, though. Kind of tempted, but... That's still, let's, you know, let's display it somewhat normal, I suppose. Um, and you know what, to... I have no anti chaos yet. These will have to be the protectors of heaven, so... Let's do those for now. Alright, now we just gotta hope we don't get attacked in a single turn here. We can reach there easily in a single turn, so you might be able to reach me too, but we do have a garrison and three characters now. Right, speaking of characters, who wants to lead this army? Probably not you. Maybe you. Uh, some decent buffs. Do you get any better buffs? You have replenishment. Yeah, I'll use that for now. All right, so we still have a bazillion buildings to build, but we also got loads of attacks to attack. That is definitely a ward. Um, I could force. No, I can't actually. This is already in force march stance. Okay. Let's just get over here. Get over here. All right. So there's his army in march stance. The farmland, however, probably gets too much of a garrison for me to attack all of that at once. At once. Do I just take the salt mine first? Big garrison there too, but I'll probably still auto resolve that one. Can you reach the salt mine in a single turn? In Force March stance, yes you can. Otherwise, possibly not, but possibly yes. Would be a little bit risky if I do that. The option is, other option is to just attack him right now. Also, since that is left, I could attack with this, but this is actually kind of a dead army. Um, <laughs> fucking, I can't believe that shit. Um, military infrastructure. Right. Still only have two armies here, so nothing's changed here at all, really. Let's continue the siege. I can, however, take this army and possibly attack him. Nope, I can't. Well, in that case... I will not be attacking him. Um, I know, it's it's what a surprise. I can attack this with two armies, uh, one of which will have some interesting units in it too. We will attack from two different sides, however, that would kind of suck. Although I can just kind of... You know what, yeah, I can besiege with him first and then run this guy a little bit around the side and then it should be okay. I think that's what we'll end up doing. So you're going to besiege this right now. Slightly wounded army, low level stuff as well, but we have quite a few units here that we haven't really used yet. Onyx Dragons are a decent unit that I haven't really used yet. Pearl Dragons I've never used. This is a, this will be the first time I've ever used these guys. Heavy Cataphracts we used once earlier, I think, so that's going to be fairly new as well. Um, and this main army doesn't have anything specifically useful, but, or new, I mean. You're going to go all the way back there, just so that we come from the side, rather, from, rather than from the back. I kind of want to auto resolve this one, but on the, again, I, the thing is, if I siege him out, this doesn't actually prolong the campaign at all. At this point we get low losses. Yeah, okay, fuck it. You're out of here. No point uh, postponing this any longer. I need to... Fucking hell, deployed 13,000 men. <laughs> I've never seen that number be so small. <laughs> the game did not expect that shit. Oh my god, he attacked with four armies. What are we supposed to do here? <laughs> we weren't prepared for this. Alright. Thank you, mouse. I love you. I love you, my new mouse. You're so so beautiful and handsome. Uh, okay, welcome to the crew. You can stick around. What do we get here? Wooden fish. Fucking brilliant. Everyone's friends, etc. Yep. We know this shit. Oh, someone's unhappy in here. You leveled up. And then you became unhappy with your current position. Who was it? Who the fuck is it? You, you little bastard. You got a fucking grudge against me. Yeah, you do. Well, if you weren't so damn useful... Oh my god, it costs five grand to upgrade in there. What the fuck? Holy shit, this guy was expensive to upgrade. <laughs> I did not realize that. Um, not, not that it matters. Although, I'm, yeah, I almost spent all my money. That's great. Yes. You also gotta level up here. You're not being so fucking stingy about it. Alright. Um, we can actually move now. Can we even... No, we can't reach any towns. Or can we? Maybe, I don't know. There is another army over here somewhere. There it is. Not the scariest army I've ever seen. <laughs> I was... Okay, I guess we're moving on Boxy next turn. Um, I guess I... Yeah, I got some money to spend, but we got a battle to do as well. So what else is there? I ask of you. Is, uh, yeah, there's a battle here. Siege out there. It's just these four towns now. You're probably going to take that next turn. So yeah. Oh, there's actually five towns. It's that one too. 
And there's still Sima Ying himself, yeah, which we haven't fought yet, and I'm a little bit disappointed by that, I gotta say. Okay, we can actually see now this guy is actually really good. So he has, surprisingly, 90 points, because he has a minus 10 instinct. That's kind of interesting. Uh, and then we have this guy. Is he also one of those? No, he's just a regular old dude. This guy is also regular. But this guy, however, is also just regular. However, this guy, right, he's also just regular. Um, yeah, let's do the battle. Fuck it. We meet again. Would you like to surrender? No. Well. Then you will meet your doom. Wait, do you also fear? No, that's stock. What the f- Can move hidden. <laughs> that's actually pretty impressive. Trebuchets can hidden. Can move hidden in any terrain. Well. <laughs> that. Is something. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like slight fucking bushes and grass, slightly tall grass, trebuchet trampling, trumping through like, or trampling through I guess, just every leaf of grass behind it stays on the floor because it's destroyed by the wheels of the trebuchet, somehow still unseen because of its stalk ability. Alright, perfect, we can set up back here. No explosive shutdown. Actually, we don't want to set up here, it'd be here. Be fucking here, wouldn't it? You little bastard. You haven't got a clue, do you? Oh, peasant. Yeah, a oh, peasant band. Sorry. Uh, pearl dragons. So sort of cheeky peekatees, because I haven't really seen these guys before. That weapon is awesome looking. I was going to say, they look about as simple as I expected them. They've got 7% armor. Just 67% melee evasion and 60% armor block. Or uh, range block chance. The problem with this kind of unit is just that. Like, they have high survivability, and they have good damage as well. They actually have quite a bit of damage, good attack rate as well, even for a level 2 unit already. But infantry just doesn't kill fast enough. Like, there's just there's just no point to have any special melee units, or infantry units. You just want the tankiest of the tanky dudes, and you want your cavalry to do the damage. Or at least, you know, in my, I'd say, relatively extensive experience at this point, that is just the best thing to do. There is, there's no real option there. You just build the most defensive front line, and then you you use uh, the most offensive fucking cavalry, charge the shit out of everything, and these guys essentially become pointless. Like, what am I supposed to do with them? Do I put them on the front line? They've got shit armor. They've got a good range block chance, but my dudes with shields have both armor and the range block chance, so it's just a bit mad. Do I flank them around? Sure, I guess that's possible, but if they get charged by cavalry, they're fucking dead. All right, fine. So, what what is their what is their goal then? What do I do with them? You know, it's just it's difficult to make that decision. I think. Anyway, enough about me. How's your day? I do have a lot of formations, but again, not really something that is. Oh, you do have spear wall. So yeah, you are. I mean, I, I, again, I'm not surprised by that because I still think this should be an anti cav unit, but it isn't. So, uh, you guys go there. You guys go blear. I am kind of corner camping here, unintentionally, I must say, but still, it is a corner camp. So, ranged boys, make room. Make a room for the ranged guy. Uh, both of you, explosive shit. Explosive diarrhea. Let her rip, boys. Okay, once we get this all set up, I might still move forward anyway. I do kind of want to use these guys, though, so I'll still put them somewhere up front. Just maybe flank around with them. Usually, flanking infantry doesn't get too taken up by calves, so it's not really a ma massive concern or anything. Mage of concern or anything. You're 75 movement. You're 79 still, though, so you're going to be the one that goes up. 70. Shanty. This enemy army is in uh, march stance, by the way, so it's going to be tired as fuck. Yeah, they look cool, and obviously these guys are fucking brilliant as well. That heavy armor actually looks fantastic. Especially with this red color of our faction, it looks really good. Really good. Yeah, it's pretty, uh, that's what I call the bee's knees. If I were from the 70s. Right, where art thou, Sima Liang, my uncle? Cousin, grandfather, I mean, could go either way, really. Okay, um, 
They appear to be stationary over there. Are you gonna make me come towards you? Or would you do me the honor of coming towards me and walking into the fire of my... Nope, you're gonna stay there. Well, that's your prerogative, sir. I will make my way to you in a... fashionable but rather slow <laughs> way. Are those those two? Yes, go like that, please, because that just looks fucking disgusting. Uh, also, you may run. Are you running? You're already running. My bad. I do apologize. You guys may just go over there somewhere. And the four of you will make your way over yonder. You, on the other hand, will go seek out Mr. Liang. And see if he might be interested in dueling. If so, you will not accept his duel. It is just an inquiry. And that is all this. There he is. He does want does want to duel, as well as his friend. <laughs> it's like he's it's like we're saying he's gay. He's like your friend can also stay for dinner. Um now are we there yet? I mean a large portion is a large portion? A large portion is. Unfortunately our trebuchet is um <laughs> if only they had the stalk ability. Um Oh god, this is gonna take ages. Do I have a duelist who wants to go just juke it out for a second just for fun? Do we have an, a, a debuff ability? Yeah, you do. Alright, let's make it up here and we'll bring you over. You and you are gonna be denying jewels. You might do one, but are you well equipped? No, not at all. Well let's bring this man over and just do a duel then. Just get into range of him. Try not to get into range of him then, so approach from the left side. Approach the army from the left side. And prepare yourself for a duel. Fucking hurry, we're not even remotely in range yet either. We lost fucking vision on them, hello? Hello, I'm here for a duel. Ah, oh, here we are. No, that's not the one I want. That's not the one that I want. There's the one I want. There we go. Fucking run like a mad lad now. Further, 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 further. Over here, over here. Yes, yes, that's good. That's good, yes. Okay, he's gonna follow me all the way up here. The duel's gonna take place around here somewhere, probably. Yes. Yes! Murder this man. He deserves it. He had it coming. He killed your mother. Okay. By the time he... Yeah, it's gonna be around here somewhere. This is good. You, you've got some pearl dragons too, man. You have, you, you've seen, you haven't seen my fucking pearl dragons. All right, we are almost here. Actually, I guess when we're here, I'll start moving up again. Nah, I'll do it. I'll do it now. All of y'all, these guys are like, ah, oh, ah, oh, we're finally here, <laughs> and then immediately, no, we gotta move further. I'm afraid. Sorry. Okay, I need to make room for my actual units as well. Let's go right there. We just came from there. Alright, it's actually gonna take more more over here actually. There it is. Alright. Shi Yan versus Shi Shu. Fight! Get done, son. I'll see you hang for this. Do you have a. Do you have hamstring? That's fucking shite, isn't it? Oof. Not looking good for Shihan to begin with. Boom. Get done, son. Every fucking attack. Taking chunks off of this man. I will revel in your destruction, he says that he's literally dying. Okay, the debuff still six more seconds. He's gonna kill him before the debuff runs out. Ooh, it's not the craziest notion. Oh no, I just ran out. And then he missed instantly. Oh no, wait, never mind. That was the other guy. One more attack, 2k HP. Yeah, one attack will kill him. One hit will kill him. Oof. Oof. Xi'an making a fucking comeback here. He's got 788, 799 health each, even. Oh, I can read numbers. Come on, you can do it, man. Don't disappoint me now. Oh, you did it. Didn't even have to use the ability. Alright, who, uh, who, who wants some? Would you like some, sir? I don't think I want to kill him, actually. He's pretty well equipped. When he joined that faction, he was just given the best gear. Ah, Siba Liang, yes. 
You are very welcome in our faction. We have long awaited for someone as awesome as you. We know you lost your own kingdom. I'm not trying to sound racist, by the way, just as a, you know, a, a, t a, a, a just a, cheek, a cheeky FYI. What is happening right now? I'm so confused about this enemy sitting back. You know what? I think I am going to shove another episode into this campaign. <laughs> it almost, like, honestly, it start, it's starting to sound like I'm doing this on, I'm doing this slowly just to get another episode in to this campaign. But honestly, no, I'm, I'm not. I am actually just enjoying this one. I'm, I'm also trying out new units, so I've got even bigger reason for just um, sneaking another episode and doing another battle or two with those units I've just recruited. Like the Onyx Dragons I never use, I, yeah, Pearl Dragons, I'm about to unlock the Protectors of Heaven. Um, there's uh, the Yellow Dragons, I'd love to see them in action as well, I've I've seen them once or twice. They're one, another one of those units where they're super aggressive, which sounds great on paper. You know, Nodachi Samurai were super strong in Shogun 2, but in this game it just doesn't, it just doesn't work out that way. Units don't die from infantry. Or maybe I'm just playing the game wrong. Who knows? Could be any of those things. Uh, I'll go further. I'm not actually that far away anymore. So honestly, just like up there, perhaps we'll do it. Do it. Can we just teleport forward in time, like two minutes? Come back to screaming of units just dying. Did they have a um? Yeah, they have a strategist. Ooh, my sound's doing a weird sound bug again. The sound is doing the sound bug. Man, what a surprise. Can't believe the sound bug's doing this. Or the sound is doing the sound bug. I thought the uh, the video was doing the sound bug. Well, that would have been a proper surprise, now, wouldn't it? Right, so you've got the spear wall, and then you've also got... Because you, this reduces your ranged block chance, which is your one of your massive, your major strengths, though. But it's obviously against Cav, and you've got Hollowed Square. Which somehow doesn't reduce your ranged chance, or range block chance. Right, if we could just fire right in there, right at this fucking second, now that would be brilliant. Because these two units right here are just a fucking distraction, right? Do it. I want to see it. I want to see those shots land now. There it is, but it's a bit fucking late, isn't it? There goes the loose formation, but yeah, when you got that many units sitting around, loose formation doesn't do fuck. Unit kills, uh, 37, 56, 41, 29. Here comes another volley. It's just too late, though. Like, if it was uh, 20 seconds earlier, we would have done so much more damage. Still doing damage, though, so, you know. Okay, I'm hearing all the shots go off in the background, so I can cancel and put them on fire at will. And we'll go back to... I'm still surprised he's not coming towards me, actually. Oh, fuck me. Look at this cab continues over here. I mean, I got heavy cataphracts. I don't think these guys are going to lose any calf fight ever, to be honest, but still. Fire. Wait, they had a trebuchet of their own. That's why they're sitting back. It appears to be just sitting. Oh, no, it's firing. Oh, no. What the hell is wrong with you? Why is my unit like that? Why is your face like that? <laughs> got him. Oh, I got him good. Oh, here comes the cavalry. Pingmy? Fuck, dare you. You guys are actually still hidden, so let's keep that, keep that up. Is this all open land? No one need to worry about getting stuck on little cabins and shit. Yeah, there's a few, but it's okay. It's okay. Oh, you guys are not in a good formation anymore either. You are also a bit forward. Oh, there's a cabin behind you, I got you. I got you. Oh, you're also completely out of formation. How witty, how very witty. Oh shit, they're getting wrecked already. What is happening right now? Are you even trying? Don't shoot my Onyx Dragons. I finally get to use them and I get shooting them to death. I mean, how dare you? You disgust me. Oh man, that unit got fucking destroyed. What are we on right now? 315, 273, 173, 225. Those ones don't even have explosive shots. So that's actually pretty good. They're definitely, you know, closing the gap. Between having explosive shot and not having explosive shot. I think the nerf was a good one. Trebuchets were just too overpowered. They were too... You, you have to have them in, in armies. And I still think they're pretty good. Just for the, the fact that enemies will tend to come towards you because you have trebuchets if they don't. 
Oh, that's why they sat back, of course, because in this case they had them. But yeah, that's uh, that's definitely still worth them recruiting them for. But you you would possibly consider recruiting just one instead of two. Like honestly, I think two. Are, I I think two is still honestly quite low. I think I could have recruited more in my campaigns, but I decided that that wasn't that much fun. Ooh, I got the movement speed as well, so these guys got 66 speed. We start fucking up Sima Liang there. I mean, currently our Trevish is having a fucking field day, so I'm not too concerned about that yet. You guys are hit, no, longer hit, no longer hidden, so I might as well move them up. Start triple speed this battle? I mean, what is going on right now? Okay, they're coming again. They just weren't coming for a while. They're sitting back like, yeah, we got the range advantage. Do you know? That unit just got absolutely evaporated. The other cab's running. Oh, wait, never mind. They just somehow managed to hide. Oh, they all have the stalk ability. Right, that's what's going on. Yeah, they just... Those hedges, I told you, man. They are fantastic at hiding dudes, apparently. Jesus. Oh, wait, did someone charge in? What just happened here? Oh, they must have got hit by a trebuchet, right. They go kill that man for me, and... You go help out with your debuff, please. No, I'm gonna pass on that jewel, I'm afraid. Oh, you might want to help out as well, actually. Okay, just debuff him and absolutely slap him to bits. He's already getting wrecked. No, don't fucking chase down my lady. What the hell's wrong with you, man? Don't do that to a lady. Not to a lady. Okay, get charging in there. Get charging in there. You guys just kind of go over here. Other cavalry, go over here. I kind of want to see this these heavy cataphracts charge in the back of something. You know what? Since I well, they're up against other pearl dragons. That kind of sucks, but let's try and send them through here. Oh wait, yeah, you need to go in there. Uh, you need to go in here. Yeah, is he dead yet? Attack this man, please. Him specifically, I want dead. Alright, he's getting fucked now. Good. Cataphracts, go in there. I don't know why I just love putting the. Um, what do you call that? Like, instead of saying cataphracts, saying cataphracts. Because I know it's wrong. Oh, he killed Simo Liang. What a shame indeed. I know it's wrong, but it just. I don't know, there's something about saying things wrong, just to see if people will react. It's like I'm a troll, and I hate trolls. Okay, you need to route now, because you're being a little bastard. Okay, I want to see this cataphract charge, actually. Actually, I'd like to see this cataphract charge. Go on, cataphract charge. There we go. Oh, my dude is hanging back. Fucking die! I mean, it looks the same as every other charge, don't get me wrong. This isn't special or anything. Ugh. I mean, the mass on these units must be insane, though. Like, more so than other cap units. I don't know if that, actually, if that is a thing or not, but it ought to be. I mean, I know a mass is a thing, because generals have a mass. But I wonder if uh, a cataphract for units, for example, also have a higher mass than a lightly armored unit. You'd think so. I mean, why wouldn't it? It's a heavy spear cap, so I think the fact that I think the, the medium, light, and heavy is probably what makes them certain masses. I actually wouldn't be surprised that that, that just just the, simply the word light, heavy, or medium um, has an actual function too. I would not be surprised if that's true. Since again, since we know mass is a thing, if you upgrade your horse, you get a higher mass with lower speed, for example, because your dude is more armored, and I think it's armor related. So the higher armor a unit has, the slower it might be, but it also has more mass on the charge. Anyway, we took that old man out again. Now I'm going to occupy his settlement. Well, not his settlement, but you know. I'm going to do a level up. Still no explosive shot, but we're getting close. Uh, and I'm going to upgrade your farmland too, because you probably can't do this. You're such a little bastard. And then we still have a bunch of buildings to do. Hello. Um, which I will do. There. There's a building. And look. There's another one. Now, look at this one. That's another building. These buildings... The fact that they cost absolutely nothing to upgrade as well doesn't help. Okay. Look, I mean, 119. I bet you there's still a fucking building out there I can upgrade too. Look at this shit. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll take a free upgrade. 
That one too? Yep, that one's free too. I mean... <laughs> what kind of fucking joke is this? <laughs> what game am I playing? Oh god. Okay. Right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do this. I think actually I'm at the end of the turn, but still, I'm gonna continue the siege here. We're gonna do one more episode in this campaign. I thought I was gonna end it, but we're gonna do the one more. Um So we're gonna take out uh, yeah, we gotta take out Baxi, we gotta take out this place, which will be next turn, we gotta take out this. Maybe I'll do one final siege here. I was hoping to fight Sima Ying on the battlefield, especially with Sima Yong, because then we gotta Sima Ying, Sima Yong uh, face off, which would be great. I'd like to have gotten you over as well. Oh yeah, you can actually still move right now, so let's do that. Don't know if he's gonna actually get anywhere near in range, but yeah, I could even wait for him really. If I'm gonna make, if I'm gonna do one more episode, I might as well. Um, and I'll do one that again just to save the game. So now that, that's the plan. Hopefully we can fight Sima Ying, but hey, maybe he just doesn't currently exist. I'm surprised he doesn't want peace anymore. He was uh, very much for it. Not too long ago, and I appear to have only gotten stronger since. And I was like, "Hey, just wait a second. I want to fight you. I bet I can take you." But anyway, that'll be that for now. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the sub ultimate. Is that what it's called? It's called sub ultimate episode. Um, but yeah, one more, one more to go. I think the next episode we're going to finish this one. Uh, but uh, until then, thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Have a good one, and goodbye.